Good morning YouTube and welcome to the channel. Today we start our first video in a series covering the Steiner 430 Max. We'll be covering some of the attachments that go on the front of it, how the machine operates, and some of the neat features that separate Steiner from other garden tractors. The model we have here is a 430 Max. It is the Kubota diesel. It has the D722 21 horsepower. These are four wheel drive. They are hydraulically driven, not a hydrostat. And we'll cover the difference there. Uh, this mo particular model does have a cab on it right now for winter, obviously. It does have the three point category zero hitch, which is a nice feature to have with them. Stay tuned, like I said, we'll be covering different attachments and how they operate. Today I just wanna focus on the V-Plow. What we have here is the Steiner BD358 V-Plow. Now there's some options on this you can get from Steiner. Um, one being these cutting edges that are extended out as part of a wing kit that you can purchase. It's an add-on option gives you the cutting edges, and obviously it gives you the wings. Um, extends it out on each side by four inches. Also allows you to throw snow a little bit better, in my opinion, and obviously clear faster. Another upgraded option from Steiner is normally you would see just a snowshoe that's just a bracket that bolts on, it's adjustable up and down, and it comes back and the plow rides on it. These are called the heavy duty snowshoe attachments. They were an option from Steiner, and it allows you to obviously have a much more heavy-duty pad, and you can do very minute adjustments, one washer at a time, as you would need to raise or lower this uh, on whatever surface you're using. So let's go over how this works. I'd never seen a video where it actually showed you the operation of the V-plow. There's just some that show you it plowing. Um, but how this works is, on the Steiner, there's two hydraulic levers. You have your up and down right here. And this is for your front attachments, up and down. And then you have your up and down here. This is your auxiliary port. On the Steiner tractor, at least on the 430 model, you're going to see the auxiliary port is located right here. Now, this tractor also has the rear three-point hitch, so there's a control valve for that right here. But these are your hookups that are going into your V-plow. So you'll hook them up here, obviously. And what it does is the hoses run up and they come into this hydraulic diverter block or hydraulic solenoid. It's a very simple circuit. It's on off. When you flip a switch on, it will control one cylinder. When you flip the switch off, it will then control the other cylinder. I have it set up with a trailer plug for those electronics. The wires come around, they come in here, and it just goes into a simple trailer plug. I'll pull this off so you can see it. It's just a simple plug. Steiner sends you a two-way plug. I decided to go with a four-way plug because I also use this same plug for the snowblower attachment that I'll cover in another video. So all you do when you're hooking and unhooking this is go ahead and plug it in and you're good to go on the electronic side. Now, inside the cab, I do have a switch set up here. Very simple, you have an on-off switch and then you have a momentary switch that goes left and right. So it's a double pull, double throw momentary switch. That'll be for the snowblower. And then this one on and off is for the V-plow. And how that works is when it is in this position and you control the lever up or down, it's gonna put the wing on this side, the right-hand side, forward or back. When I flip the switch to this position, it's now gonna put the wing on the driver's side, forward or back. So you can put it in a full V back, or you can put it in a full scoop forward. You can put it straight across, you can have it angle left, and you can have it angle right.
All right, so with the wing extension kit, let me see if I can't get a good measure for you here. So the plate, plow comes down and goes in. So at full extension, you're at about four inches on each side. Let me see if we can't get a total width. End to end, 70 inches when the V-plus fully open. So almost a six foot blade on the front of a tractor. All right, in the fully V back position, Sixty-four inches. In the fully V forward position, it's at fifty-eight inches. Hey guys, thanks for checking out my video on the Steiner V plow. Hit subscribe. I got other videos coming. If you're interested in Steiner, got any questions? Put them in the comments below. I'll try to get them answered.